Dear friends, this is tutorial 4 in Material Studio. In this video, you can learn modeling of orthorhombic graphene based zigzag and Ahmshire graphene nano ribbons. So, this nano ribbons are now widely used for the various DFT calculation for uh, electronic uh, properties uh, like conductors and other a uh, lot of uh, things. Okay, so if you want, you can utilize this video and uh, make this kind of uh, nano ribbons start your research so already i showed this slide in the last presentation the unit cell parameter for orthorhombic graphene so this is the a b c this is actually a this is b okay this top one is c x this okay this is the unit cell parameter i did not optimize this unit cell parameter so please optimize unit cell parameter before do the your studies so this is nature paper published uh, in nature group so in this paper the model showed that uh, what is zigzag and amcha just i want to show you the model what is zigzag and amcha so if you see the zigzag model you can see find this it will go like zigzag orientation is uh, called zigzag uh, graphene so if you see this is a hamcha so here you can see look like a chair form with handle so this is the hamcha form these are the two important uh, cutting in the graphene okay so this uh, two hamcha and uh, zigzag model i created for you so i will show you how to create this model using material studio that uh, orthorhombic uh, graphene unit cell okay so just open material studio and i will i will drag the postcard uh, the zip file of uh, the orthorhombic crystal so just make it bond and uh, display style so item and click ball and stick okay so that's all first uh, we will make the armchair so so to build go to display style so in lattice you can see here we can make a 4 into 2 okay so now we are making the armchair so this is the 4 into 3 unit cell so just close it then you can go to modify not modify go to build symmetry super cell create 4 into 3 ok that's all we have got 4 into 3 units now we have to delete some atoms in the graphene so in order to make the nano ribbons ok so just uh, you can select you can just you can uh, mouse left click and uh, drag so which atom want to delete just uh, select the atom want to delete just uh, select and delete it okay here also you can delete this uh, two line the last one so now you, you have got your nano ribbon so in order to fulfill this valences we need hydrogen atom so for that what you have to do select all the atom and uh, go to here and make partial double bond this is the partial double bonded one huh? so just make it and then you can click this H just you click it it will add the hydrogen on the this position the terminated per position okay so then if you click this it will change that one no problem so if you want to more uh, c c axis length just you can uh, increase i think go to build crystal so here you can let this parameter you can adjust here how much you want you can adjust you want 15 means you can put 15 so it will increase so uh, that's all so just i will use it all only okay that's all then you can save this as a zip file so already i showed many videos just to go to file and export so here you see different kind of things select zip one and you can uh, save it so i did not save here okay so this is the first one so now I will, we will make a 
zigzag one okay so for that just uh, go to right click and uh, display style lattice so 6 into 4 we can make so now we are going to make a zigzag positions okay just uh, similarly go to build symmetry and the super cell click ok and close it so now we, we, we have to delete some uh, lines uh, some items so just to select it which do which i don't want delete it here also something you don't want means just to delete it so if you want only three line also no problem just you can uh, remove this one so you will like uh, like three benching thing is there now like this then uh, similarly you select everything and uh, make it uh, bonds into partial and add atoms hydrogen atoms to get a uh, valency okay then you can click this one so so now we have got our zigzag graph you can see here zigzag orientation okay so uh, that's all make your uh, graph in nano ribbons and do your research thank you for watching if you like my content please like subscribe comment and share and also please click the bell icon for my future update and thank you thank you for watching thank you for time happy computing